Welcome to Acadiana Live, everyone. Happy Friday and happy festival weekend. We are in New Iberia for the Spanish festival, joined by our beautiful queens, three of them at least. We have our teen queen, we have our miss, and we have our junior queen. And we're gonna hear, we're gonna get all the details about the festival. Shaysen, we'll start with you. What's going on today at the Spanish festival? So today, the first thing we have is at five o'clock, we're gonna do the blessing of the crocheted ceilings, and then we're gonna move straight to the festival grounds. We have some music for the night, and also the craft vendors will be open and the fair opens at 5 and it will close at 10. So much to look forward to. A great start to the weekend. Again, it is a three-day event, so Saturday. Tomorrow is actually a really big day. Sydney, what do we have going on tomorrow? So tomorrow we have the dedication of the tiles at City Hall. Following that is our parade. It starts at 10.30 and it will go from City Hall all the way here to Bowling Plaza. Of course, we have our carnival rides and games and we have quite a different variety of music. We have flamenco music and some Spanish music as well as some um, different bands such as Clay Cormier and the Bad Boys. And Chloe, wrapping up the weekend, what do we have going on on Sunday? Well, Sunday we have the carnival still open and then we also have the huh? music. music all day <laughs> and yeah, pretty much it. Now, what are you ladies looking forward to the most? Anyone can answer this. Um, uh, you know, being it's the festival that you're reigning over, what are you really excited for? I guess we'll do Shaysen first. I know me personally, I won in 2019 and never got to have a festival, unfortunately, due to the circumstances of the year. So I'm very, very excited for this to be my first ever festival to reign over and just to take it all in, yeah. introduce myself, listen to the music, and just have an overall great time. Sydney, what about you? What are you most excited for this weekend? Um, getting to see all the people come and enjoy our festival and getting to know what New Iberia is all about and how it was founded by the Spanish and letting them see that excitement. Chloe, is there anything in particular that you are just uh, pumped up about and want to get other people excited for? I am for? so excited for the jambalaya and paella uh, <laughs> because I can't wait to smell the great food and have a great time. Now paella, tell us more about paella. It's very similar to jambalaya, isn't it? Yes, so um, actually the way the French got their jambalaya is through our paella. When the Spanish came, it was one of their Spanish dishes. It's a yellow rice with um, saffron seasoning with like pork and chicken all mixed up and cooked in one big pot. And it's so interesting how New Iberia, you know, most towns around here, everybody's French, everybody speaks French or Cajun French or something like that. But New Iberia was uh, settled by the Spaniards, which is so interesting. So there's lots to learn whenever you come out here. Of course, we don't want to miss the um, the ceiling, the, the crocheted ceiling that's in Church Alley. Yes, ma'am. So I know I talked about a little this a little bit more, but it's um, the crocheted ceiling by uh, the decorts and then it was that's what it's kind of all about, just kind of to see the different things out there. And I'm very, very excited for everyone to just take it all in because it's something that's very unique to our yeah. festival. Not many festivals have something that is just about like where it comes from. Mm -hmm. So I'm very, very excited for everyone to see it. Well, we're glad you ladies joined us and uh, you guys get out here. Everything starts at 5 p.m. today, the New Iberia Spanish Festival in Bulani Plaza.